Hey guys, good morning. I am out of my face wash and I was gonna show you guys really quickly how to make your own. It's very, very simple and you know all of the ingredients in there. And we're going to do an HD clear face wash. It's really awesome. So if you guys haven't tried this blend before, it is really amazing. It's the topical blend. It just helps with blemishes, keeping your face clear, and this is undiluted. So all of these oils in here are straight up oils. There is no carrier oil here. Um, it's just the essential oils. So there is HD clear foaming face wash that you can purchase if you don't like to make your own, but I like to show people other options and how to save their pennies and stretch their dollars. So I'm just going to show you how to make your own here today. So I use the On Guard hand wash dispensers. These are really great and I just kind of labeled it face wash as you can see here. You can get three of these in the back office from mydotero.com for $5 and they are awesome. You guys have seen me use these with my hand soap. I just label them here. You can also buy ones that are pet grade, PET grade on Amazon that you can use with your essential oils or glass storage containers that have the foaming dispenser on Amazon. This is the one that I like and especially since this is going to be in my shower when I wash my face. I like to use the plastic just in case I don't want it to fall and break. So this is what we're going to be using here. And we will just open this up. And what we're going to do is add, kind of similar to our hand soap, our foaming hand wash, we are going to use our castile soap. So again, this is Dr. Bronner's pure castile soap. I really love this. You can get this at natural, natural grocers, on Amazon, any of those places. And we are just going to do two tablespoons of this in our little dispenser. And a little bit goes a long way. So this is a big, this is a 32 ounce container of the castile soap. And this is going to last you a really, really, really long time. And then I like to top with two teaspoons of whatever carrier oil you like. So I usually do coconut oil. You could do almond oil, macadamia nut oil, olive oil, whichever one resonates with you. I'm a coconut oil fan. And doTERRA has fractionated coconut oil that you can use. This is the Invivo one from Amazon. And I like this one because it has the big pump bottle there. So we have that there for us. And it's just, I just like the ones that have the big pump bottle, it makes it a little bit more convenient when you're making rollers or shareoils.com actually has the little pump that you can purchase that fits on top of the doTERRA one. So there's lots of options for you there. And then now we need to add our essential oils. So since we're doing an HD clear foaming face wash, we're gonna use our HD clear. So to open this up, to get the roller off, you actually, if you put the lid halfway on and pull up, that will loosen the lid. So I kind of got it halfway off. I'm going to rotate a little bit and pull again, and that will pop right off. So that's a tip for you to save your fingers when you're making rollers. And you just can get a little pipette or a little dropper. Amazon has these. Lots of the essential oil places have these. And we're just going to add 10 drops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And you can start with that. If you like it stronger, you're welcome to add more. We can add a couple more of the HD clear here. I could kind of use the whole pipette there, um, but a little goes a long ways with this. And then to put the roller back on, I usually like to set the roller bottle on the countertop here and you can just press down to get that back on. Or if you put it on top and then you just press and twist, that will come back on as well. So we've got our essential oil here, just depending on how strong you like it in there. And then we're just gonna to top off with water. So really, really simple. We know everything that is going into this face wash. And we're only using a couple drops of everything. It's gonna last a really long time and you can play with it. You can start with 10 drops. If you like it stronger, I tend to like it a little bit stronger. So I added like a little pipette full, um, but you can just play with that and put your lid back on. The tricky part is finding just the right amount of water to still be able to get this lid on. And then with the Sharpie, I just wrote that this was my face wash. And that is it. We just made HD Clear face wash in just a matter of minutes and it works great. So if you're looking to decrease your toxic load, wanna know everything that's in your products that we're putting on our face, on our skin, this is a great option for you. I hope you try it out. And if you do, tag me. Talk to you later.